Welcome to the Daily Geosense Challenge, presented by You Got a Friend in PA and Rob, the Geocache Muggle. Welcome to a Daily Geosense Challenge. Today we start off where we left off yesterday. Look familiar? The wheels for an old uh, rail car? And we're at the Ironton Rails to Trail. I'm going to go try and push it. Sure you are. Take it up and put it in the back of your truck. That would be a strongman competition kind of thing. There you go. I sure as heck ain't that. See how far he can get it up there towards the kilns that we showed you yesterday. Today, we're going from the kilns, from cache one. We're going to head down this way towards cache number two. We'll show you anything interesting on the way. And we'll bring you today's daily Geosense challenge. That must be an honor of somebody. There's a picture on it. Oh, okay. Wow. The wind chimes and that plaque have the same last name as the bench. Christian. This one's Christian. Mit, mit, mit. Oh no, they're the same. That's mit, his nickname. Mitz. Mitz. Must have been a baseball player. Doesn't look too uh, old either. No. And there's something down there that's all worn out. Can't really see. Yeah, and then there's a fake butterfly in a plant. Some people pass too early. Oh yeah, this is a section that goes to stone. But it's so packed down, you can't tell. Today's container. A camouflage preformed tube. Cash page has this as other. Two difficulty, two terrain. Now, let's show you three locations on where this preformed tube can be. Take a look at those now, and we'll be back for the elimination. Now, from the old rail line next to the IRT, are you going to find this cache at number one? Here's the walk-in. Walk straight in. Down here's the rock. Move the rock. Reform tube from the old train line next to the IRT trail. Do you walk straight in for this geocache? And do you come over here to location number two? Location number three from the same position, the old railroad bed next to the IRT trail. Do you walk in towards ground zero? And will you find this container here in location number three? Okay, preform two, three locations. One, two, or three. You've seen where each one is. Now, leave a comment down below with your answer in it. And just to help you out just a little bit. Let's knock you down to a 50-50. Mm. Like we always do. So, obviously, number two is not it. Yep, it's a 2-2, two -two, but it's not number two. Right. It's not a 2-2-2. Two -two -two. That's a different highway. <laughs> That's for all you locals. Route 222 runs from Allentown to Reading, then down into Lancaster triple deuce and now right before you make your choice and before we tell you which one's right go to you got a friend in pa.com for all your daily geosense challenge needs find out when the next giveaway is going to be and find out all the updates for the giveaway on you got a friend in pa.com and now back to what we were doing 
it is finally time for Rob, the geocacher muggle, to tell you where this is. Uh, you like to do the honor, sir? It's in number three. Number three, yes. The best spot here. I know you're probably saying the same thing that I said. Why is it another? My speculation is because it's hidden inside the tree. Hmm. Maybe that's why they made it another. To me, yeah. I probably would have made it a micro. He didn't want you to know what you were looking for. Yeah, wasn't hard. We just now realized after two of them, we don't need to be on the trail side. We need to be on the railroad bed side. Yes. Well, folks, that's going to end today's episode from the IRT. Tune in tomorrow for another episode from the Iron Tin Rails the Trail. See you tomorrow. Happy trails. Happy cashing. Go get a smiley. Later.